Hey everyone, how's it going? We made it. It's the end of week six, the weight loss journey, and as always, we're going to take a recap, look back at the week, the workouts and everything, and we're going to do the weekly weigh-in to see if I've lost any weight. So the last two weeks, we've been stuck at 283 pounds. When I first started this journey, I was 297, so 14 pounds lost so far. I'm happy about it. Hopefully we get over that hump this week. We'll find out shortly. But this week, uh, I had two rest days, and it really did me some good. It, it really, really helped me, uh, help my muscles heal up. What was nowhere near as sore as I usually am. It felt good. <laughs> and the workouts themselves, I had, a, I had a really good week of workouts. I started waiting every other day to, uh, for the weight lifting. I'll lift weights and do the elliptical. Then the next night, just the elliptical. The night after that, weights and elliptical. So that really helped too, waiting every other night to do weights. My arms aren't sore anymore. And I've noticed I'm still gaining strength. I've been able to do even more reps with the weights this week. So that was good. That was awesome. But, hey buddy, I got a little tiger down here. He's staring at me. He's, he wants some treats or something. <laughs> but it was a good week of workouts. I even set a personal record on elliptical Saturday night, which was awesome. So yeah, with that being said, we're going to take a quick look back at the, uh, the workouts for this week. So let's take a look at the workouts now, and we'll come back. Today we did 40 minutes, 2.73 miles, and we burned 346 calories. All right, so today's tonight's workout is done. And you're probably wondering, where was the weightlifting? So um, I made a decision about the weightlifting. I was advised by a couple people in the comments who uh, have been doing this a lot longer than I have and were in much better shape than I am, that you really only need to lift weights. Uh, it's better to wait, what I mean is it's better to wait 48 hours before uh, lifting weights with the same muscle group again, just to give your muscles the proper time to heal. And after doing some reading and research on it, that is true. Uh, it says while lifting weights every single day will help you gain strength faster, you're not letting your muscles heal properly and you can end up, excuse me, doing more, man, I'm burping up the water. And you can end up doing more damage than good, so it's best to wait 48 hours for lifting weights with the same muscle group again and since I'm only doing arms uh, I was doing it every day so I think I will do weight 48 hours so I'll do the weight lifting every other day but the elliptical will be every single workout no matter what <laughs> uh, we're getting closer and closer to doing one hour um, around a 30 minute mark sometimes I start getting my lower back starts to uh, hurt a little bit so I mean it is what it is 40 minutes is uh, it's better than where we started at. We started at 30, we're up to 40 now. We're slowly but surely working our way up to an hour. <laughs> yeah, I burned 346 calories, 2.70 whatever miles it was. I can't even remember now. I've got the uh, calorie display up there. Yeah, I feel good about it. Uh, next workout will be the weightlifting and the elliptical. Yeah. I think that's going to be a wrap for tonight. I'm going to go in the house, take a shower, wait for my idiot neighbors to start setting off fireworks around 1 a.m. instead of right now at 9 o'clock when it's perfectly dark because my neighbors are idiots. <laughs> they really are, folks. You have no idea. The two across the street are idiots. The rest of them are cool. But that's going to do it for tonight. So I will see you next time for the workout.
And as always, let's get it done. Okay, tonight, we did 40 minutes, 2.71 miles, and we burned 343 calories. Oh, man. All right. Tonight's workout is done. So good. Mm, excuse me, I'm sorry, I apologize. That was kind of rude. Oh man, it's nice work I was done. I feel good about it. And I tell you what, um, I noticed a big difference between not lifting weights every single day, you know, just doing it every other day and giving my muscles a chance to heal and relax. I did more reps today with the weights, with the dumbbells and the barbell than I've ever been able to do before. So, gaining strength and uh, waiting every other day is definitely, uh, definitely notice a difference. It paid off tremendously. My cardio is still horrible, but it's so much better than when, what it was when we first started. I'm able to maintain the same speed. And my speed, I mean my pace. <laughs> I'm not like these people where you see running on the freaking thing the whole time. I can't, I can't do it the whole time. Maybe for a little while. But um, I don't have to slow down and basically to a walk anymore. I can pretty much keep up a, a good pace throughout the whole 40 minutes. And man, oh my. Uh, one week from now, I'm going for an hour live. I'm starting to wonder what I got myself into, but uh. We'll get it done, we'll definitely do it. But, uh, for now, I'm just gonna sit here for a few minutes, uh, 
catch my breath, relax for a little bit before I go in the house and take a shower. I might hop on Twitch and uh, live stream some Resident Evil revelations. Probably talk to myself the entire time, but I have fun with it. So with that being said, that is the end of tonight's workout. I feel good about it. That being said, that's it for today. We'll be back out here tomorrow night. And as always, let's get it done. Today we did 40 minutes, 2.80 miles, that is a record, and we burned 353 calories, I think that's another record. We did 2.8 miles, that's a record. 353 calories, I believe that's another record. So very good workout tonight. I have noticed that waiting every other day, as I said in the last, I'm pretty sure I said it on the last workout. It's making a huge difference waiting every other day to lift weights. We lift weights one, one day, skip them the next day and then go back to them. You know, after that, huge difference. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna keep this short and sweet because I'm hot. I wanna go out, I wanna go back in the house, take a shower, relax. Uh, it's Friday night, it's almost 9 p.m. So Joe Bob Briggs is about to come on. Yeah, an awesome workout tonight. Two personal, personal bests, calories burned and miles walked, I guess you could say. Good workout overall. So with that being said, that's gonna do it for tonight. We'll be back out here tomorrow. 
Saturday night. And as always, let's get it done. Okay, today we did 40 minutes, 3.11 miles. Holy crap, we did over 3 miles. Burned 387 calories. Oh man, I don't know how to flip this around. I'm recording this on my phone right now because I forgot to empty the memory card on my camera this week and it uh, filled up and stopped recording while I was up here. So I'm recording this part with my phone and for whatever reason it won't switch around so I can feel my face. So I won't be able to do a uh, post-workout talk tonight, but man, 387 calories, 3.11 miles, that is freaking awesome, man. So yeah, we got the neon clock over there, it's a good night. So this is Saturday, um, I'm about to go in the house, take a shower. And watch some horror movies, man. Gotta do Saturday Night Horror. So I'll be back out here tomorrow night with a, an empty memory card. <laughs> so until then, let's get it done. Tonight we did 40 minutes, 2.88 miles, and we burned 361 calories. Oh, man. Whew. All right. It's a nice, ugh, I got sweat in my eyes and it burns. Tonight's workout is done. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, it's my workout is done. Uh, didn't get three miles like we did last night, but uh, 2.80, whatever it was, is still good for me. Man. Uh, I had the fan on. It is still unbearably hot in here. Uh, these summer months are going to be rough in here. But that's why I'm doing it at night, kind of. Uh, man, I can, I can only imagine how much hotter it would be during the day. But that is the end of the week for workouts. I feel good about it. I feel good about it. We did a, uh, had a lot of good workouts. Um, I've said it before, waiting every other day to lift weights is, is definitely paying off. I'm not, so, I'm hardly, I'm, I'm not nowhere near as sore as I used to be. And I improved the number of reps I can do with the weights this week, so that's awesome. Unfortunately tonight, uh, usually when I'm in here, I watch YouTube or Twitch. Uh, for whatever reason, the internet crapped out on me right before we go on the elliptical, so no big deal. I started with the old DVD collection. Been watching Power Rangers Zero. <laughs> Power Rangers Zio while I was on the elliptical, excuse me. So yeah, I'm on that Power Ranger kit, going back watching all the Power Rangers. But anyway, I've rumbled on long enough. Um oh, get on these gloves. I feel good about this week's workouts. Feel good about the way in tomorrow. And I think that's gonna do it. I'm gonna go in the house, take a shower, put all these workout videos together, edit it and all that. Uh, get a head start on tomorrow's recording. And then just relax. Might hop on a PC, play some seven days to die. Again. <laughs> but with that being said, that's gonna do it for tonight. Next time I see you, it will be tomorrow morning, Monday for the recap and the weigh-in. Hope I lost weight, man. We've been stuck at 283 the last two weeks. Hopefully, we, if we get over that hump tomorrow, we, we shall see. I feel good about it. So with that being said, this has been week six of workouts. Is it week? Yeah, week six. It's been a good week. So I'll see you for the recap and the weigh-in. And as always, folks, let's get it done. So there you have it, an uh, awesome week of workouts. Like I said, Saturday night, set a personal record on the elliptical, over three miles, which is awesome. Uh, Tiger is now on my lap. Bella has just come in the room, so the cats are, yeah, the cats are awake, which means all hell is about to break loose. <laughs> so the time has come. It's time to step on the scale and see what my weight is at the end of week six. Uh, as I said earlier, the past two weeks we've been stuck at 283. Hopefully we get over that hump today. So, did I lose weight? Did I gain weight? Or are we still stuck at 283? Let's go step on the scale. Let's find out. All right, so we're about to step on the scale. Like I said before, when I first started, I was 297 pounds. We've been stuck at 283 for the last two weeks. So let's find out what the weight is now. Mm. Your weight is 281.7 pounds. Your weight is 281.7 pounds. All right, so we've lost two pounds. We are over the hump. That is 16 pounds total. All right, so there you have it. 281 pounds now. We lost two pounds. Not a huge loss, but it's a loss. So slowly but surely, chipping away at the weight. So in total, 16 pounds lost the last six weeks. That's awesome, man. We're almost at the 20-pound mark. So 16 pounds lost, we have 281 pounds, which means we have 101 pounds to go. 101 pounds left. We're almost less than 100 to go. So I'm happy with it, man. A loss is a loss. I'll take it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get upset at all. Two pounds is two pounds I don't have to deal with anymore. Thank goodness. <laughs> so yeah. 
16 pounds total loss so far. I'm happy with that. That's awesome. So that is it. That is going to do it for the week six recap and weigh in. I'm happy we got over that hump uh, the last two weeks of being, staying at the same place. We're there. We're, we're back on track. Hello, Bella. The cats are just following me around this morning. <laughs> They're being big babies. So anyway, that's going to do it. Uh, thank you all for watching. And thank you, everyone, for your support, your positive uh, messages. I appreciate it. I really do. So that's going to do it here for the Week 6 Recap and Weigh-In. I will see you next week for the Week 7 Recap and Weigh-In. Let's, uh, man, we might be in the 270s next week if all goes well. That's awesome. I haven't seen 270 in years. <laughs> so anyway, I'm out of here. Uh, it is now 12 p.m., so it's time to make a smoothie. I'll see you next week for the Week 7 Recap Weigh-In. Y'all have an awesome week. Y'all take care.